안녕하세요. Hello, K friends. In our day-to-day -day lives, it is difficult to always make fancy and complicated dishes. So today, I want to introduce a dish that is still delicious, fresh, and healthy. It is bulgogi rice in less than 20 minutes to make. Let's get started. Side preparation. When the water boils, add the washed broccoli. Steam it in a steamer for about 1 to 2 minutes. After 1 to 2 minutes, remove it from the water and let it cool on a plate. Sprinkle a bit of salt and a bit of pepper. Add about 1 tablespoon of olive oil. Mix well. This will be served as a healthy side dish later. Vegetable preparation. Cut the carrot into moderately thick slices. Cut them thin to cook quickly. Slice the mushrooms thinly. Cut half an onion into appropriate slices. Cut the four green onions into appropriate lengths. Slice the five cloves of garlic thinly. These will be stir-fried with the meat later. Mince three cloves of garlic finely. This will be used for making the bulgogi sauce. Sauce preparation. In a bowl, put 2 tablespoons of soy sauce, 1 tablespoon of oyster sauce, 1 tablespoon of sugar, 1 tablespoon of honey, 2 tablespoons of cooking wine or meat in, 1 tablespoon of minced garlic, half teaspoon of minced ginger, a little pepper, and 1 teaspoon of gochugaru. This is optional. You can adjust the amount of gochugaru to your taste. The bulgogi sauce is now ready. Meat preparation. This beef was pre-sliced the New York steak parts bought from Costco. The thin sliced beef should boil for bulgogi seems fine. Remove some of the blood with a kitchen towel. Cut it into bite-sized pieces about three times. Today, we will use the meat without marinating it in other bands. If the meat is tender and soft, it tastes good even without marinating in other bands. In a preheated pan, add about 1 tablespoon of cooking oil, and then add a sliced garlic to stir fry until the garlic fragrance emerges. When the garlic aroma emerges slightly, add the meat. When the meat is about 80% cooked, Push it into one side of the pan and add a sliced vegetables. When the onions become somewhat translucent, pour the prepared bulgogi sauce over them. Wow, smells so good! You can serve it over rice as it is, but for a more delicious and glossy finish, you can add a little starch mixture to adjust the thickness. Turn off the heat and add 1 tablespoon of sesame oil. Sprinkle some sesame seeds as well. Place the rice and broccoli in a plate and place the bulgogi in the middle. Very savory and nutritious bulgogi rice is done! How was today's recipe? I think this is a great dish to make when you don't know what to eat for a meal. What are your favorite quick dishes to make? Thanks for watching. I will see you next time. 감사합니다. 안녕히 계세요. Bye bye.